Hey there. So today we'll do the review for LiveSpace. Uh, you might have seen this uh, their ads in IPL and every now and then. So let's see how their culture is, what the employees talks about. So we'll go through some of the review comments made by the current and former employees. So this is from one of the former employees who worked for more than a year. And they are saying uh, salary is okay. Uh, too much of corporate politics is played in this company. So if you are thinking of joining this company, just take a note of the politics played inside this company. Another review is uh, compensation is the only good factor, which is the positive thing or the good thing. So you'll get good paid here. But the con says manager level is pathetic, means really, really worst. He has used the word pathetic, it must, uh, so it must be meaning that management is really bad. They only pressurized for number. If you don't achieve number, you will get fired. It means that job is also not secure here. Half of people get fired in probation itself. So if you want to risk your life, risk your career, then this is the place you want, you can go. Okay, good place to growth, long working hours. Another uh, feedback is good company, but no job security. So people are saying there is no job security. They can suddenly take decision and fire you. That's really bad. No work life balance, hopeless managers. So manage, people are really complaining about managers. So advice to the management will be to either change the managers or change the managers. <laughs> That's the only thing. Current managers are not at all doing anything good for this company. Uh, another review from one of the current employees, nothing huge like any of the pros and cons with a good, a good startup. Another uh, feedback, he has given one star, there is a lot of one star rating for live space. Unprofessionalism, favoritism, partiality and toxic environment. So if you want to have some experience of toxic environment and favoritism, politics, uh, pathetic management, then live space is the place for you. This is as per the review comments by their current and formal employees. No work, uh, work lab balance is there. As per uh, one of the formal employees, he has given one star rating. Let's see what he, why he has given one star rating. When I joined, it was the best place to work. No micromanagement, but everything changed after 1st December when someone who doesn't even know the difference between call center and consultants joined and made our life hell so this is some senior people who joined this company and made the, their employees life hell what the person think that they are we are robots and want to work nine hours continuously it's not a call center he should understand this so i think uh, hr and management needs to take care of their employees again it's a three star rating nobody's interested in teamwork once their role is over avoid providing an input from from therein no help from the managers seniors your captain of your project your manager won't help if project has issues multiple reminders are required to push the work work life is going down the drain so these are really bad review comments given by the current and formal employees uh, let's go to another review comments too much workload, too much politics. So this is getting repeated. So it means uh, many people have felt this same bad culture experience. Constant no support, ex expired leads, costing of products. <laughs> expired leads means leads are really pathetic here. Uh, another employee has given uh, two star rating. Unorganized and ever changing work work structure, unhealthy clients internal staff let's say bad management in terms of execution and timeline no employee career growth with respect to efforts and hard work so there's no career growth as well in this company this is for the previous um, former employees uh, another review comments is uh, work pressure is too high in this company former employees who is worked for less than a year no pros in this organization <laughs> means there is no benefit he saw in this organization. Cons is they have a pathetic work life balance in Pune. They believe the candidate does not have their life. 
they give off on Sunday and Monday and bloody hell I had to work on both the days simply you have to work seven days so if you want some t to work at some place where you have you can work for seven days this is the place for you if you want to get pathetic experience this is the place for you <laughs> even pants up some guys take a leave but not at all possible in leather space just keep pressurizing employees to achieve unrealistic target so if you want to disturb your work life balance go and join this organization this is as per the review comments no work life balance no value for work no value for current relationship customer relationship things are really bad in leather space i don't know why virat kohli is doing the ad advertisement for this company horrible hr policies and financial commitments and apart from salary like incentives or variables are not fulfilled at all okay so they do make false promise and hr policies are really bad as per the employee feedback work life balance is bad and experienced team okay also the advice to the management is hire good filled relative experienced people Uh, slightly higher pay in the, if you uh, in this uh, organization, but work culture is toxic. It's poisonous. It's toxic. The management in Pune is pathetic. Managers don't know the, or understand um, anything. Designers don't. Designers don't have work life here. Too many comply complicated process. And design is the most ignored space. it is a huge scam and fails to deliver good design execution so at the end of the day designers are exhausted even not satisfied with the product politics and dealing with biased managers on daily basis take a toll on mental health so i think uh, in every aspect people have uh, written that things are not great in this company poor management employee recognition is poor too many policies changes actual working hours are too hectic too many process for a simple task poor hiring process things are really um, bad as per the review comments in this company now uh, again to start reading uh, blame game and finding scapegoats scapegoats so i think senior management really need to learn or changed no proper check for bandwidth of an individual no incentives whatsoever promise something on joining letter but provide nothing verbal communication of terms and clauses press writing if not booking projects hr team is weak in getting into the employees regarding the pressure heat they face from their respective seniors unhealthy way of bookings unethical way of bookings no direct involvement of managers into the project and this is well established startup struggling to win a startup early a startup properly so he has written a story kind of where to start from hr is for the name sake means that hr doesn't have the power here they don't work for the employees they will blind you with uncert unnecessary pol policies when they will make you sign and then use it against you and please read on what you signed in for Pune team is run by general managers, one of which has serious temper issue, micromanagement, control freak, and politically insane. Poor customer is all I can say. <laughs> Marketing has gone from bad to worse lately. So I think management, clients, handling, managers, HRs, everything is bad. As per this review comments, people are writing toxic culture, pathetic managers, very bad experience in my life. it's very political in nature they behave bad they behave very badly so overall i'd say uh, if you are thinking of joining this company definitely go and read the review comments because these are really not good sign for a startup so thank you so much for watching today's video and if you think the videos are helpful and do like the video and subscribe to the channel